Hourglass plans to go vegan, the real dangers of shopping for makeup on eBay, and can you really catch an STD from a tester? I'm Jen from Jen Loves Reviews, and What's Up in Makeup starts now. Welcome to What's Up in Makeup for November 5th, 2017. Let's get started with the top industry news. Hourglass Cosmetics announced that it is going fully vegan and that it will revamp its ingredients list by 2020. The brand already sells predominantly vegan products that are not tested on animals, but plans are to eliminate animal-derived ingredients, including beeswax, lanolin, and carmine. They're asking experts in biotech to find new ingredients that don't sacrifice quality. The price range of $18 to $350 will not change as the brand evolves. Hourglass will sell a limited edition vegan leather makeup bag online, contributing all of the profits to animal rights. A recent report by Market Research Future expects cruelty-free products to grow about 6.1% by 2023. Google's latest report on skincare trends found that searches for vegan products have grown 83% year over year since 2010. Shiseido has announced it will close nearly half of the 209 bare mineral stores in the U.S., according to WWD. Launched in 1995, the bare minerals parent company, Bare Essentials, was acquired by Shiseido in 2010. Famous for its mineral foundation, the brand has struggled in recent years in an increasingly more competitive market, though the company claims that a full 30% of American women use the brand. Shiseido affirms that it will continue to invest in the brand. In contrast, the Estee Lauder companies issued a forecast of holiday quarter sales well ahead of market expectations, apparently thanks to those acquisitions of brands aimed at attracting millennials, such as Too Faced and Becca. The company also credits having signed on influencers and celebrities to promote its products. The strong forecast followed better than expected sales and profit in the first quarter, as sales in the Asia-Pacific region and Europe soared. Quote, we benefited from a continued acceleration in China, Hong Kong, travel retail, and global online, Chief Executive Fabrizio Freda said. In the United States, though, brick and mortar sales have been falling. The company's greater use of cosmetic retailers, Ulta and Sephora, have helped it offset any hits to profits. Disney fans, we know you've been waiting for this one. The Bessemer Cosmetics Snow White 1937 collection launches this month. You know Bessemer for their throwback style and classic formulas. Snow White's creamy skin and dark rouged lips are a hallmark of vintage makeup looks. The colors in the collection are based on the original Disney cell and background colors specifically created for the film, all universally flattering for a polished look. Here are the highlights. The 1937 storybook palette is $68 with 20 shadows. With a smile and a song, cream rouge is $20 or with a smile and a song eyeshadow palette, $43 in two colorways. Classic color lipstick sticks, $24. Those come in four shades. Seven Dwarfs Mini Lipstick Set, $35. Snow White Travel Bag, $35. Or Book Motif Makeup Bag, $15. The Fairest Vanity Mirror is $40 and more. The collection will arrive at Bessemer's flagship store in Burbank, California and will also be available online at Bessemer, Maud Cloth, and Sephora, as well as the Disney Family Museum in San Francisco. But... If you prefer your princesses more on the modern side, Mally Beauty's new Frozen makeup collection just launched on QVC. This holiday line features shadows, liners, mascaras, lip glosses, and blushes in two gorgeously packaged kits, one for Elsa and one for Anna. $49.98 each. There's plenty of makeup that claims to give you a glow to the heavens, but what about glow in the dark? Some brands are taking that idea to a level that requires you to turn off the lights. But safety questions are popping up about these highlighters. The FDA, which only tests the color additives used, has pinpointed luminescent zinc sulfide as the only FDA-approved compound used to create the glow-in-the-dark effect. While it can be used on skin, it should not be used every day and nowhere near the eyes. Experts recommend you perform a patch test and not hesitate to remove the product if there is any redness, burning, or stinging. 
thing. And it's not only about putting it on, it's how you take it off. Check the labels for any removal instructions, be extra careful around your eyes, and then use both an oil-based cleanser followed by a foaming cleanser to completely remove the chemicals. That's a lot just for a few hours of glowing in the dark. Reporters at Florida's NBC2 News recently wanted the answer to the question, are counterfeit cosmetics really harmful to humans? And you will not like what they found. The products in question came from sellers on eBay and claimed to be discounted versions of designer products. The products arrived in small black bags labeled clothing, suspicious. The news team then brought them to Princeton Consumer Research in St. Petersburg for analysis where differences in color, application, and texture were noted. They were then sent to that company's labs in the UK where the real trouble started. All of the counterfeit products contained, quote, significant quantities of lead and aluminum traces along with rat droppings. Yes, they contained rat droppings. One fake also had traces of mercury. Barry Druitt, PCR technical director, noted, quote, the biggest problem is banned substances can penetrate through the skin and go into the bloodstream. The last thing we want is for someone to become ill because of a fake product. For example, lead poisoning can cause memory loss, muscle pains, and headaches. Aluminum can accumulate in the brain and tissues causing memory loss and dementia over a period of time. Exposure to mercury and eye makeup can damage your vision permanently as as well as damage to the heart, kidney, lungs, and brain. Bacteria-invested fake makeup can lead to serious skin rashes. And as for rat droppings, among other things, they're just gross. <laughs> so yeah, when you see a modern Renaissance palette for $5 on eBay, you might want to skip it. This week, we heard TMZ report that a woman in California is suing Sephora after claiming a tester from the store gave her herpes in, quote, exact alignment with a 2015 visit. This was later diagnosed by a doctor as oral herpes. The unnamed customer bases her claim on never having had a cold sore or herpes prior to the visit. She's suing the chain for strict liability negligence, intentional infliction of emotional distress, and negligent infliction of emotional distress, and believes the company should have warned customers about the risk of contracting an infection. According to the CDC, oral herpes is most usually caused by HSV-1 and may result in fever blisters or cold sores in or around the mouth, but can you catch it from a tester? To quote an article in Popular Science, Calm down. Herpes is primarily spread via skin-to-skin -skin contact or saliva. If someone with HSV is experiencing symptoms like cold sores, they go through, quote, viral shedding, which is just what it sounds like. According to the article, herpes can't survive long outside of the body, but it's technically possible that it could hold on just long enough to infect a new host if two people use the same lipstick in a very quick succession, especially if the second user had open wounds on their lips. Think chapped lips. It's a horrifying prospect, but how horrified should you really be? Again, the article cites a 2015 study by the World Health Organization, which found that two out of three people under the age of 50 have HSV-1, aka oral herpes, plus some 90% of people who are diagnosed with herpes by way of blood tests have never had symptoms and had no idea they had it. Which brings us back to product hygiene. Many stores have their policies and spread but even if they mounted huge flashing signs or programmed robots to remind customers about best practices, you must remember this. Ultimately, the responsibility is on you. Do not apply the contents of any testers directly to any area of your face, even if it is brand new, completely pristine, and free of bacteria and viruses. You could contaminate it with your own. So. Be a good human and think of the next person. We don't know what will happen with this lawsuit and we'll keep you posted of what changes it may bring. Until then, protect yourself.
but there are good things going on at Sephora as well. Their holiday reach out and gift campaign, which encourages people to connect with others through beauty gifts, includes a diverse group of their own employees. Over 1,000 cast members apply to be a part of the campaign with a video talking about what beauty means to them. And 10 were selected from across the US and Canada for the campaign based upon celebrating different perspectives and a diverse sense of beauty. Chosen were Shaimei Bouillard, a hijab-wearing Moroccan employee, Joanna Samano, who suffers from alopecia, and Tyrell Britton, an esthetician who works at Sephora in Beverly Hills. Diversity and beauty? It's beautiful to see. In events news this week, BeautyCon London is on December 2nd at Olympia London. Tickets range from £30 to £120 plus fees. IMAX New York tickets are now on sale. Pier 94, April 13th through 15th. Friday Pro Day is $40. General admission Saturday and Sunday are $65 per day. And in who ate all the candy corn deals? Save up to 60% off on House of Lashes and storage cases at their site now. At Nordstrom, Jouet, Fet Fabulous set with an eyeshadow duo, bronzer, eyeshadow crayon, cheek tint, and lip gloss was $54, now $27. And at Hot Look, Crown Brush is up to 60% off, and Japanese cosmetics are up to 62% off. Now let's get into the product reports, starting with Sephora. Don't forget, Sephora's semi annual sale is going on right now. Rouges get 20% off from November 3rd to 6th, and again from November 10th to 15th, with the code 24Rouge. VIBs get 20% off from November 10th to 15th with code 24VIB. And Beauty Insiders get 15% off from November 10th to 15th with code INSIDER15. And ColourPop is now at Sephora. Here are some highlights. The Golden State of Mind eyeshadow palette is $26. Semi Precious Shadow Palette, $26 as well. Super Shock Shadows, $5. Legit AF Super Shock Highlighter Trio, $24. You're a Gem Lip Trio is $18 and the Amber Crystal Collection Bundle is $20. This week from Huda Beauty, the Contour and Strobe Lip Set is $25. Create Huda's signature contoured lip look in five colorways. Winter Solstice Mini Lip Strobe Collection is $33. Four Frosted Mini Strobing Metallic Lip Glosses. Highlighter Palette Winter Solstice Palette is $45. Obsessions Eyeshadow Palette $27. And from Wander Beauty, Iconic kit. $45, a five-piece kit with full-size must-haves. Lancome released the Glow For It Highlighter Palette. It is $39. Neutral shades for cheeks, eyes, and lips on all skin tones. And these items are available online only from Hourglass. Confession Lipstick Archive is $650. 30 Confession Ultra Slim Refills and two gold applicators. Clinique's Beyond Perfecting Powder Foundation Plus Concealer is $28. It does come in 15 shades from Christian Louboutin. The Rouge Louboutin Metallissime Lubilac Lip Lacquer is $90, or the Rouge Le Bouton Metallissime Sat Silky Satin Lip Color is $90. I think they made those names up. I don't think those are real, but more power to you. It's your line. Call it what you want. Both in the color Rouge Le Bouton Metallic Red. From L'Occitane Advent Calendar, $69, 24 irresistible surprises, including many customer favorites. Bite Beauty Malvember Collection is $24. Support Malvember with this limited edition shade for 2017. Malvember available as either a multi-stick or a Muse Bouche liquefied lipstick. And finally, this week's edition of Weekly Wow features items from Tarte, Smashbox, Cover FX, Paracone MD, and T3 with save up to 50% off. At Ulta this week, the new Ulta exclusive Maybelline and Gigi Hadid Coast to Coast collections are in stores today. East Coast Glam Matte Lipstick in three shades or West Coast Glow Matte Lipstick also in three shades, $8.99 each. East Coast Glam Lipstick and Lip Liner Kit or West Coast Glow Lipstick and Lip Liner Kit, $16.99 each. East Coast Glam Eye Contour Palette or West Coast Glow Eyeshadow Palette in two colorways, $14.99 each. Sensing a trend here, then we have the East Coast Glam Tinted Primer for light tones or a West Coast Glow Tinted Primer for deeper tones. Those are $11.99 each. The collection also includes makeup brushes and more to get that effortless, chic, Gigi Hadid look. 
From the Ulta brand this week, we have the Love Makeup 72-piece collection for $24.99, a reusable train case available in green or pink filled with cosmetics. Beauty Treasures 73-piece collection is $29.99, a jewelry box style case with drawers filled with cosmetics. This week from Bare Minerals, the Bare Sensuals Ready Eyeshadow Palette is $45 with 14 sensual shades. Beauty Icon $12, a three-piece set with blush, gloss, and brush. Dose of Colors released the Hidden Treasure Palette at Ulta $50, a mix of shimmers, foil metallics, and mattes. From Urban Decay, Naked Foursome, $185, a vault with the Naked, Naked 2, Naked 3, and Naked Heat eyeshadow palettes. Naked Vault Volume 4 is $195 with the Naked, Naked 2, and Naked 3, with nine lip shades and three lip pencils. Julep released the Matte Lips Don't Lie Special Edition Lip Mousse Vault for $249, an ultimate collector set of 25 matte lips. From Tarte Park Avenue Princess Chisel Palette is $46, four matte bronzing powders and two matte highlighters. Lash Flash Eye Set is $22. Tardis Quick Dry Matte Lip Paints in New Shades, $20. Chrome Paint Shadow Pot, $22 in three shades. And the Tardis Lip Trio is $15. Lancome released the Color Design Lip Kit for $29.50, four full-size lipsticks in must-have shades and texture. I co-released the Brow Game Strong. It's $25 in two different shades. Creamy powder in one end and angled brush on the other. And these items are available online only. The Stila Shimmer and Glow Liquid Eyeshadow, $24 in eight shades online now and in stores on January 4th. Persona Identity Eyeshadow Palette is $32. 12 wearable shades, and this is only at Ulta. Lime Crime is new to Ulta this week, a vegan and cruelty-free brand available online only. The Venus Pressed Powder Palette or Venus 2 Pressed Powder Palette, those are $34 each. Matte Velveteen Lipsticks available in 37 shades or Metallic Velveteen Lipstick in 11 shades, they're $20 each. Bubblegum Pocket Candy Pressed Powder Palette or Pink Lemonade Pocket Candy Pressed Powder Palette or Sugar Plum Pocket Candy Pressed Powder Palette. $34 each. Unicorn Highlight Palette or Mermaid Highlight Palette or the Opal's Highlight Palette, those are $38 each. Diamond Crusher Lip Topper is $18. This does come in 18 shades. And then finally from Lime Crime, the Diamond Crusher Cracker Box is $25 in three colorways. In high-end news this week at Saks Fifth Avenue, Trish McAvoy Eye Palette 3 is $59. Set includes three eyeshadows, two glaze eyeshadows, shimmer eyeshadow, and three definers. The Gucci Illuminating Powder in Sunstone is $53, gives an iridescent effect to the skin. At the Tom Ford website, Winter Soleil Eye and Cheek Palette is $155, a reflective clutch with four shadows, highlighter, and a blush. The Orchid Soleil Lip Color is $54, an ultra creamy lip that matches its namesake fragrance bottle. The Soleil Night Bloom Powder is $80 in the shade Soleil Bloom, also inspired by the Orchid fragrance. Fragrance. At the Cicely Paris site, the Fido Blush Twist is $68, a long-lasting cream-to-powder blush. And at the MAC website, velvet mattes are $17.50, nine new blackened mattes in the deepest, darkest tones. At the Lancome website, La Absolute Rouge Hydrating Shaping Lipstick is $32. It comes in two shades, Rose Lancome and Rouge Caprice. And their holiday blockbuster, La Parisienne Holiday Case Glam Set Beauty Box is $63.50 with any Lancome purchase. Includes full sizes of the Monsieur Big Mascara, two color design eyeshadow and blush satil palettes, two lipsticks, two lip glosses, four more products, plus a cosmetic case and a train case. In drugstore news from Revlon, Colorstay Brow Kit is $12.99 in four shades. Colorstay Brow Mousse, $11.99 in five shades. Colorstay Eyeshadow Primer is $8.99. Photo Ready Galaxy Dream Holographic Palette or Photo Ready Sunlight Dream Highlighting Palette is their $14.99 each. And this week from e.l.f., the Lip Parade Lip Balm Set is $5. Little Brow Book Eyebrow Kit is $10. 
$10. And we have the Desk to Dinner Look Du Jour, $5. No Budge Eyeshadow Stick, $4 in five shades. Color Correcting Liquid Primer, $8 in three shades. Holographic Highlighting Duo, $8 in three combos. Holographic Eyeliner Pencil is $1. Holographic Highlighting Stick is $4. The Correct and Set Under Eye Powder is $4. It does come in three shades. Real Techniques released the Color Correcting Set. It is $19.99. The colors of the brushes and sponges coordinate with key correcting colors. And from CoverGirl, the Peacock Flare Mascara is $8.99. True Naked Eyeshadow and Lash Blast Mascara Holiday Gift Set, $11.99. Wet n Wild Mega Glow Highlighting Palette is $14.99 with four new vegan limited edition shades. From JCat Beauty Matte and Shimmer Lip Vault or the Holographic Metal Eye Vault, those are $19.99 each. From Essence and the Lovely Little Things Eyeshadow Palette is $5.49 in three colorways and the Lovely Little Things Face Palette is $5.49. Two highlighters, two blushes, and two contouring colors. My Must Haves Palette is $3.49, a customizable palette in four or eight color sizes. Fill it with your choice of these. Eyeshadow in 21 shades, Satin Blush in three shades, Bronzing Powder or Highlighting Powder or Fixing Powder, each in one shade, $1.99 per shade. At QVC, where leftover candy is the ideal companion to $3 shipping from Bare Minerals, Box of Wonders, 24 Days of Surprises, $71.84, a 24-piece surprise kit with face, skin, eye, and lip delights. Gen Nude, four-piece Radiant Lip Collection is $34. The Brush Hour, three-piece brush collection and brush roll is $39.96. Christopher Buckle, five-piece vanity kit, volume two is $49.96. Foundation stick, mascara, eyeliner, lipstick, and setting powder in your choice of eight colorways. Nude Sticks Influencer 8-Piece Mini Lip Collection, $59 featuring gel color lip and cheek balm sticks. And from Doll 10 5-Piece High Shine Liquid Lip Collection is $41.78 infused with avocado oil, camellia oil, and vitamin E. Julep Matte Lips Don't Lie, its Whip Lip Vault is $249 at QVC, 25 lip shades. Again, what more could you want? And from Guerlain, the Maytay Reads Pearls Illuminating Powder with Brushes 6815 choice of fair, medium, or deep. Eve Pearl Flawless Face a Four Piece Collection is $54.86. Foundation, concealer, palette, and lipstick in five shades. And from QVC Beauty, Color Cosmetics Six Piece Collection is $16.86. A multi-branded collection anyone would love to receive. Christmas Advent Calendar 24 Piece Kit is $63.96. Countdown each day with brands you know in this colorful collection of makeup, skincare, fragrance, and more. From Laura Geller at QVC, the Starlit Collection set of five eyeshadow palettes is $109.98. Named for Audrey, Betty, Grace, Marilyn, and Sophia. Beauty Canvas six-piece artistry collection is $54.98 in five shades. And from Mally, that Disney's Frozen seven-piece collection is $49.98. You get Elsa or Anna for that price. Each kit features a selection of Mally's favorite products in shades that invoke the amazing spirits of these two characters. And then finally, one more thing we've got for you at QVC. There is going to be one, not two. I just said that, that was two. One TSV this week on November 11th, It Cosmetics. It's your top five superstars and more. It's $59.95 plus free shipping and your choice of seven shades. In Indian cruelty free news this week, Beauty Escape Cosmetics launched the Stranger Things inspired color shifting products on Halloween. Demogorgon, a teal blue and purple shadow. Vessel Hydra, a green black and rose gold shadow. Eleven, which is a peach teal green and pink shadow. Those are $6.50 each and the Upside Down, a purple, green, and pink shifting metallic lip gloss is $14. ColourPop released the new Supernova liquid shadows in five metallic colors. They can be used as a base, topper, or alone for $7 each. And as you know, ColourPop is now available online at Sephora.com and in select stores. You can purchase Sephora exclusive eyeshadow palettes, Super Shock shadow bundles, and lip bundles. Rewind to the Sephora section for more information.
information on that. Frosty Shadows has released their Snow Castle Holiday 2017 collection featuring loose glitters, loose highlighters, and oppressed highlighter. Prices start at $4.50 for glitters or get the whole collection for $55. One of my favorite brands, Geek Chic Cosmetics, dropped a spectral light eyeshadow set. These six blue tone eyeshadow shades are available individually for $5.99 or in a collector's tin for $20. Give Me Glow Cosmetics now has the Sepia Rose Garden Beauty Box as part of their new monthly box releases. Each box will contain six brand new full size products in their Sepia Rose theme at 30% off total value for $44.25. Glamour, I hope I said that right, released their Color Splash palette featuring 35 colorful shades in varying formulas. Get yours on sale now for $27 before the price goes back up to $42. The Carity Holiday 2017 shop is now open. Visit their website to find a wide array of stocking stuffers and gifts, including palettes, brushes and bundles, $12 to $74 for each product. The Kitten Empire Cosmetics Venom Bundle contains an eyeshadow and highlighter that share a name. Get yours now for $10. Kiss My Sass Cosmetics launched their limited edition color of the month for November, Sweater Weather Lipstick. The color is described as a beautiful berry with a berry muffin scent. It is vegan and dye-free, available for $8 on their website. Corsana and Cosmetics released an eyebrow pomade available at their website for $12. The formula is waterproof, smudge proof, and comes in seven shades, including a redhead friendly auburn. A holiday eyeshadow collection has released on Pretty's For Your Faces website. Colors include Celebration, Enchanted Forest, Evergreen, Holly Jolly, and Sleigh Bells. Singles are available for $5, or you can purchase the set for $20. Pretty Zombie Cosmetics released two new black and liquid lipstick shades alone purple metallic and utterly alone metallic blue those are $13 each strobe cosmetics launched six new eyeshadows available in a bundle for $35 to give you a bright rainbow of colors sugar pill released four new eyeshadow shades that double as blush highlighter and contour colors include text me matte brown $13 or kiss kiss red SWAK pink and wink which is a pink champagne they're $16 each the ball introduced a new member of the Luminizer family this week. Bonnie Luminizer is a gold tone highlighter and eyeshadow shade for $24. The Balm also released the Foiled Again eyeshadow palette for $34. Embrace your alter ego by wearing these 12 shades, wet or dry. Violet Voss is now available on Sephora.com and in select stores, five palettes are now available, including their newest Taupe Notch. Zoeva Offline Collection was created to take you to a place where you can recharge your batteries and create charismatic makeup looks with a picturesque eyeshadow palette, an expressive blush palette, and a stunning brush set. Visit their website for prices. Storybook Cosmetics released their Mean Girls Burn Book Storybook Palette on Thursday for $55. The palette features 12 carb-free, cruelty-free shades in a full-size mirror so you can see you're, like, really pretty. And that takes us right into the Sneak Peeks lightning round in three, two, one. Storybook Cosmetics sees the launch of the Star Wars product coming in 2018. Ace Beauty is planning their sister palette to their quintessential palette. Sign up on their website. Our Cosmetics next lipstick will come in candy shade packaging. Release date coming soon. Cake Makeup teases their holiday lip fondant shades in Hotter Than Wasabi. Bay Area and Shot Color Juvia's Place teases two new releases on Instagram. The Deuce Palette and the Festival Palette. And finally, Clarity Cosmetics announced the re-release of their Glitter Fusions and new lip elixir sets. Release on Black Friday, November 24th. And Clarity also sent a peek of two upcoming pressed pigments. Yeah. <laughs> Here's some late breaking news we thought you'd want to know. Kylie Cosmetics is set to open up pop up shops in seven top shop locations around the country. Is one near you? Hey, look, it's Jeffree Star on Twitter teasing his next eyeshadow palette launching in February. And focus on the handheld mirror here, it's coming as part of the holiday collection very soon. Becca sends a teaser of a new product, which apparently will be known as Light Waves to be revealed early next week. Sex Kitten is the name of this festive collection from Marc Jacobs, a holiday duo of lipstick.
lipstick and mascara contained in a cracker, $19. Speaking of holiday, take a look at the Jouer Holiday Collection set to launch November 10th on their website. These swatches are from the best of lip toppers with five favorites and two new shades, $33. Laneige Holiday Kits are hitting stores now. Geek Chic Cosmetics announces three colors of the month for November. And Coastal Scents is having a great sale on their Eclipse palette now just $4.98. And take a look at these adorable lip balms from Firebox. It's Beauty and the Beast Mrs. Potts with Strawberry Balm and Chip with Grape. Sold as a set for $11.79. Be our guest. And that's it for What's Up in Makeup this week. Thank you so much for watching and thank you as always to the fabulous and talented official What's Up in Makeup reporting team. Their faces are scrolling next to me. They are Amazing. Thank you also to the What's Up in Makeup Facebook hunters. Their names are scrolling right here. Thank you all for your submissions this week. We would not have a show without you. And thank you to Tabitha B for putting it all together for me so that I can present it in a functional way for you. She spends hours on this script every single week so that we can have an excellent show. So thank you so much, Tabitha, for all of your hard work. I truly appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. Make sure you're not missing your makeup news Monday through Friday. We do have our daily makeup minute. It's one minute of makeup news you can use every day, Monday through Friday at noon, so you can get your quick makeup news fix. We also have Makeup Minute Extras on my Instagram, which is Jen Loves Reviews. You can check out anything that doesn't fit into the Makeup Minute and some things that do that are super, super cool. We throw those up on Instagram for you as well so you don't miss anything. Chat today will be at 10 a.m. Eastern Time. I'm looking forward to hanging out and talking makeup with you in the collective brain of makeup awesomeness. I can't wait to hang out. If for some reason you miss our hangout today. You can always watch it on the replay. Just look for live chat in the beginning of the video title. And thank you again so much for watching What's Up In Makeup this week. I truly appreciate it. Mad love and I will see you in a video soon.